It just went live. Uh, thanks for the countdown. What's mm. up, y'all? How cool. you doing? <laughs> Hi. So, uh, welcome to the Scorpion Showcase, where we that, that, showcase that. and talk about anything and everything on Digital Scorpion Interactive. Today we have Joel. He is our sole and lead developer on our project. Say hi, Joel. Hey guys, I think I've eaten a half, pound and a half of chicken nuggets so far uh, for dinner. That sounds so I got delicious. a I got a big old pot belly right now. Nice. Oh, dude. I'm like a wild hog. You put me on put me on a little spigot and put me in the oven right there, buddy. Sounds delicious, man. <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah. <clears throat> So, Nick, to a short little FYI, uh, you kind of started saying it before this live actually went live, but... Well, uh, the stream starting soon screen, Ugh. in fact, is we, we actually get, you know... I like, to do, I like to do introduction when, you know, I'm in face, but that's fine. All right, Joel, so what are we doing tonight? Uh, What are we doing tonight, dude? What are we even talking about again? So I've, I've got dementia brain right now. Hopped I, up I, from chicken that's nuggets. understandable. <laughs> I get that. Um, so I think we were going to go over the implementation of one of our spreadsheets, if that was correct. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Was that is that on Slack or Discord? It's, like, on, uh, it's, it's on, on Slack. It's on It's on actually, Drive, though. It might be on Drive. Let me see. Yeah. Let's find out. <laughs> let's find out. Yeah, let's we see. will find this thing. This but, uh, is the, the beauty of development, y'all. Yes, uh, we don't know where anything is ever, and we try and keep it all in one spot. But, you know, that, that doesn't happen sometimes. Art, it looks pretty. They're, like, drawing and stuff. Audio is pretty cool. They're mixing mixing some hot mixtapes. And, like, dev, it's just, like, everyone's running around with their chicken head, chicken cut off, like, chicken head cut off. Yep, you know? pretty much. Pretty much. no one knows how to <laughs> localize. We're scrambling. We're all staring <laughs> at the screen Go, what the heck is going on here, dude? Why is this doing this thing? Yeah, absolutely. Glorious. Uh, so let me see. Arts. Okay, so apparently that global shader does change the look and feel of the little spreadsheets. Yes, it does. Uh, yeah, I, I was working on that today. I mean, to make it where like, I, like originally like it, like just like the 3D objects, they would render in front of these guys because I didn't have these guys on universal render pipeline gotcha. uh, shaders. Okay. And that's what we needed it to be. See yeah. if you set it on standard shaders. They're all pink. Uh, well, it's all pink. I don't know why it's all pink. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Blah, blah, blah. It's your standard it? shader. It's all pink. Uh, it is all pink. It's pretty cool. Thank you for watching. Uh, <laughs> what's up, Ebony? Thanks for uh, hopping in the stream. All right. Yeah. Welcome. 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 Right, it's being weird how to eat. Welcome to our hour of shenanigans. It's a, it's a great hour of shenanigans. Just screwing around watching, listening to Joel eat chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets ASMR, by the way. <laughs> Absolutely. That's, that's the goal, yeah. Get chicken yeah. nuggets and soda pop ASMR. Mm -hmm. So, Joel, tell us a little bit about what you've been, what you've been doing while you uh, find what we're trying to find. These magical, mystical sprite sheets. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, what well, depends, like this week or overall? Overall, let's like, do an let's overall, because this, this, is, this is our first uh, let's start from the beginning. So, stream, yeah. So from the beginning, in 1996, my mommy had a little baby named Joel Miller. Okay, and... that's, that's a little bit too far back, but you know. Ah. <laughs> it's still glorious. It's still glorious. Okay, yeah. it's still glorious, I hear you. Yes, the glory. Um, uh, well, basically, yeah. from the beginning, we've been working in like Corgi Engine, which is like a, an engine that works within Unity itself, specifically catered to two and two point five dimensional platformers. Okay. And so we've been kind of picking and pulling at like what kind of functionality we want from the engine, and then we gutted the rest of it out, like all the demos and stuff like that. We don't have that in there. Gotcha. Just and raw uh, functionality. What, what is a difference between a two D platformer and a two and a half D platformer? Uh, pretty straight forward actually uh 2d is like this little line right here and our guy will run along this let's go ahead and start that and 2.5 d is a bit of a catch 22 kind of term mm -hmm. but generally speaking it it can have there we go but fr from a gameplay standpoint gameplay wise it is entirely two-dimensional uh, as of you know current so you you all your actions and decision making revolves around this these two dimensions here and with 2.5d 
that can change the name of the game but usually what it refers to is maintaining this two two dimensions here in terms mm -hmm. of gameplay but adding three dimensional assets to create that depth that uh can sometimes be lacking in 2d platformers gotcha so, so would you say that this game plays more to like crash bandicoot or a different slightly different style uh think of like a 2d retro like uh hack and slash like like uh, what's it, Castlevania or something like that? Okay. Yeah, maybe maybe a bit more skeletal at the moment, but something like Castlevania. You just you know you run back and forth. You can jump and do all that stuff, and you beat the you beat these little guys up here. Oh, there we go. Nice. And, you're much, and so far, that's that, that's about the full extent of like combat. You know, they shoot at you. You try to swing your sword at it. And mm -hmm. Whoever kills who first, you know, good for you, right? And then you have health up here. You jump off a cliff and die. And then this guy can hurt you. Take some health off. So this uh, is the shader pack that he has on right now. Really brings... It kind of, sh in a sense, sharpens the image and draws a wonderful black line around everything. Which is yeah. interesting. The current bug right now is that uh, whenever objects have a, have a negative scale, the toon shader gets removed. So whenever you see... Either me or the skeleton dude running to the left, you'll see it. You see, there's no tune outline there, and then he'll break line of sight, go back to control, and you see the black outline is back. And same with my guy running. So that's kind of a bug. That's that's uh, that's R and D for another what day. What do you What do you think could be causing that? Um, Just like I said, something to do guess. with flipping the scale could okay. like disable the shader, like disable the utility behind it, and something like that. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. Okay. Or just make it not work as it should. Nice. Let me let me go in the Slack and see if I can find can find Stella's bit. So Eric, yes. What's up? How is your How's your day going, man? Uh, it's been a day. Uh, been kind of busy, but uh, yeah. There's a no. Super crazy, but uh, you know, life goes on. We we live, survive, repeat. Yep. <laughs> as as we do, man. As we do. You know, we were sitting in, and one of our uh, one of our 3D artists actually came into the development stand-up today and gave us this beautiful asset, which you can see in the corner over there. Not only the chandelier was made by this guy, but the gate that you see over there, mm -hmm. it looks absolutely it's gorgeous. Like, absolutely nutty. Oh, it does. Yeah. Man, blunder it, in it like looks, a day. It looks beautiful. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, no, it's absolutely gorgeous. That's what we're currently looking at. And then the chandelier, which was tune shaded by our wonderful developer, who is slowly getting spun up to be a technical artist at this point. Um, it's always it's a uh, always good to have a uh, somebody that can do kind of a little bit of everything, so they have an understanding. A jack of all of, trades. Yeah, jack of all trades. Like uh, with my uh, game design degree, what I'm learning at this point. A game designer is effectively a jack of all trades. Yeah. So yeah, unfortunately, like especially when you're starting out, you have to wear yeah. a lot of hats. Absolutely. And then as you get more experience, you'll develop a specialization, and then then you can work for like a big studio or something like that if you want, or start your own studio, and then find some other like-minded people with different specializations. And yeah. Then put them together, and then it's you got a triple the, A masterpiece. Yeah, all about the double studio a size. Special. Yeah, our our studio is what about what. 11, 10 people right now, right? We have 11 people at this point. Mm. Yeah. Oh, so, right, yeah. Yard, but we're, I, I we're, totally forgot they got added on the other week. Yeah, we're pretty no. small, but, you know. I mean, I consider it to be a massive achievement that we have 11 people, plus the amazing people over at the Empyrean uh, channel for sponsorship. Uh, we, we'd like to thank you guys. Shout out to Sloopy Pools, who's in the chat right there. What up, what up? And, uh, yeah, that's that's really, that's really it. We should have some uh, more people joining the party here soon, actually. Um, oh, we have a constant five viewers I'm seeing right now. Seven at this point. Seven, okay. So All I right, guess let's see. We got, stream we got Hip Booty Swagger, Jump No Jiggle Physics, You Cannot Afford My Diamond Sword. <laughs> they're, they're, they're great names, I gotta say. Yeah, yeah they're pretty... really really did really do a good job expressing your <laughs> yeah really expressing your creativity right i gotta say absolutely yeah we'll, we'll start with hit running because that seems to be a pretty easy most safe for work dude I'm, I'm ready for those uh jump no jiggle physics but for now we gotta yeah, we gotta, jiggle, do, we gotta get the boring pulse. stuff Us. so uh Jeez, joel do you remember the the little trick that i i mentioned 
before oh, we were right. trying to figure yeah, that yeah, out. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like this, right? Boom. Yep. Yep, okay. Welcome to the chat, gang. We get rid of that. Yeah, I remember that. That was pretty cool. Yeah. How many of these are there? Oh, there's not that many. Uh, not that many. Thanks actually. for the yeah, raid, sir. Yeah, thank you, thank oh, you. Oh. Let's see, hit running. Where's my, where's my player? Let's go. Oh my god, all these errors popping up. <laughs> this is development in a nutshell. Welcome to. Uh, Pretty much, we gotta watch life. me play with yeah. code for 60 minutes. We love it. Yeah, you get. Right. Yeah. We get to see a full implementation of our new player sprites. So this is the All current right. rendition of Hit right here. Um, she is looking a little. I don't even know. A little barbarish, or maybe a little bit too mystic. Let's see how that changes as we progress through the night, you know? Yeah, absolutely. Um, we could see... Oh, tell us a little bit about the character, if you could, Eric. Uh, if I could, yeah. The character is, well, like Nick was said, is a barbarian class character. Well, not barbarian. I guess it is barbarian, right? I, I'll say more It is a barbarian. It is a barbarian, barbarian who lives... Yes. She is... And that's like the class, right? Yeah. She is the standard archetypical hero of our story. Mm -hmm. She has a brother by the name of Bit, who is a dark mage. Uh, we, we say dark, but that's really just his character. Um, magic and paladin, pretty much. That's where we're going with this. And we're really excited to see where things go with mm -hmm. both of them. We both have features with them. Like there's, there's both, both of them are technically feature complete. We are in the process of building out Hit's counterpart, as it stands. Mm -hmm. So we will see that in a future art stream, probably. And, and in a future development stream. But yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. So what's this massive spaghetti that we're looking at here, Joel? Oh, uh, this is the animation state machine for Hit. <clears throat> so basically all these arrows are transitions to different animations. And let me drag this guy over here. And then we'll we'll have it play out. Uh, let's see. All right. So on spawn, we start from entry at the at the animation state machine. Mm -hmm. We go right into. Uh oh, let's see. Let's get rid of that. Go. We'll go to hit, and we'll see what's going on here. So right now, oh, let's uh, get rid of gizmos too. Get rid of all those lines. But right now, hit is. Uh, you can see she's currently in hit idle blink. That means we're not doing anything mm -hmm. to affect this. Just in his, just in her idle, kind of tired looking blink every three seconds, kind of state. So the actually, let me get rid of this. Get rid of that real quick. Now the second we start moving, oh, we got to go back to game here. Here, let me should have drug it over here. There we go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is great. Moonwalk. Moonwalk I love it, dude. Flip. All right, that's, so, that's, that's so good, backwards. dude. Yeah, it's the uh, animation <laughs> flip. Okay. It does look lovely, though. She actually, that's funny, dude. It's actually kind of fun to look at that because, you know, you look at tiny hit and then you look at big hit. Like that, big, uh, hyper-realistic hit. <laughs> yeah, no, it's actually kind of really cool. I mean, that's a, effectively the scale. Is that the scale that we want? Yeah. Okay, right. but yeah. I mean, I was I was honestly planning on scaling the entire like game up a little bit to make gravity feel more organic. Because right now it's very very light, a little too light, in my honest opinion. But I agree with you. Like you kind of you, you like jump around like a little jumping bean. I don't feel like a barbarian. I feel like a little flea. <laughs> <laughs> and then that, but but you know the, the animation is broken right now. But you know, uh, when certain parameters are met. Then that's where that's where it transitions to another animation. Like, I don't whatever I like. You see on these conditions here where my mouse yeah. is, wherever I'm, whenever I'm walking but not jumping, then I will play this animation. Gotcha. And I will play over and over and over again. Then when I stop walking, it finishes the animation, and goes back to idle. Mm -hmm. 
And just there's like a bunch of different transitions. If if this happens, but this doesn't happen, but this happens. And, you know, we combine a bunch of that, and we have a pretty pretty decent functioning state machine. Gotcha. So I don't there's still necessarily still like a, like a, think that the anime the uh, animation is broken. It's the uh, the sprites are flipped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, not that, the animation, but just like uh, didn't we originally flip the sprites to play Devil's Advocate? I think we. I mean, we we probably do that right now. Let's see. Let's, yeah. let's see. Gotta love Unity, guys. We. Uh, oh, we got to so, change it to point oh filter too. We are currently using the uh, 2021 build, which is all kinds of fun. It's great time. Oh yeah. Isn't there a flip one? Let me check this. Mirror? Yeah, I think there's like a mirror option somewhere. Uh, go I just back into the, I hit, the hit running new thing. This? Uh, no, the hit running new in the ASM. Oh, uh, let's see. And mirror. mirror. Okay. Let's, let's check that. Ooh, I got a Discord. Who's this? That's somebody. Okay. But anyway, let's give that a shot. See how it looks. Let's see what happens. Yeah. Mm. Oh, that. We got moonwalking hit. You know, it's just it's brilliant. I think I know why it's doing that. It's because uh, when Stella created this, she did it from a flipped perspective, which is fine. Oh yeah, from the left. Um. Yeah, that's cool. I mean, we we'll figure this one out. Shouldn't be that hard to fill them. No. That's an easy fix. But I like uh, how Eric and I always say that. We're we're like, it's an easy fix, yet we aren't an engine. <laughs> no, no, yeah. It's like, yeah, all you gotta do is click right. this button. I don't know where the button's at, but you gotta click this button. And here, here's a, here's another important part of game development. Google. Google Unity is fine. flipping <laughs> and animation. Animatino, hey. see? How to flip your sprite in Unity? He's yelling at you. Look at that. So rude. See? Absolutely. As we Google a YouTube video, you could use is, a boolean. <laughs> this is a yeah, mint. I mean, oh, yeah, this, this is, <laughs> this is <laughs> classic <laughs> development. This is this yeah. is what yeah. happens. Yeah, you, you go to you, Stack Overflow. What's you up, just, Poop like, Dog Eight? It. Thanks for the dude, follow. Poop Dog Eight. Thank you for the big F, dude. Big F. Appreciate you. <laughs> love the name, dude. Yeah, I love it. It's awesome. Yes, uh, sir. This is actually the game. It's just us looking at you know Google Chrome. Oh, it's on the sprite <laughs> renderer. Yeah, but that's uh, that's based on the character though. That's like based on like the actual like rendered component to the game object, which we don't want to do. We just want to flip the animation itself. So if we flip the sprite, then that'll be right, but everything else will be in reverse. Oh, it'll be an inverted. So when you press left, it'll go right, and then when you press right, it'll go left. Uh, okay. no, not not necessarily. It's just all the other animations that aren't flipped. We'll, we'll flip uh, as well. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, that's not good. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. You can ro rotate your sprite 180 on the Y axis, which does literally the same thing. Well, good golly gosh, man. You done got me there. Wait. Oh, look. Yep, the Y axis. That makes sense. Yeah, it's saying to flip it on the Y axis. Uh, I mean. Let's see, how do we go about doing that in a, in a very smart way? Break the game. A, Seems like a pretty Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Like, if I flip this, and here's here's well, what happens. If you flip it on the X. Oh, wait, yeah, if I flip it on the X, it's it'll be upside jacket. down, right? Yeah, we're gaming, so. look. I Completely poggered. Let's go! But everything else is backwards. But I mean, if you think about it, every animation that you put in, because it's been built on the facing left orientation, it shouldn't matter. Yeah, I mean, as long as like all the new animations are on the same, like flipped that same way, then you yeah, can I believe they are. Way. That's perspective that happened, which means that the sword will be in our right hand, which is cool. We'll be able to clearly see it. Wait, mm -hmm. wait, 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 wait. Who is Poop Dog 8? 
I would. Oh, okay. well, apparently, back back when this was being brainstormed over a beer, when was when was this? <laughs> Oh yeah, look at this. I love we, this. We've, we've, I feel like we've had many of those. Oh, that is a... Yeah, we have. We've had a lot of people come into our lives and talking about, you know, our beautiful game and mm -hmm. where, where things came from. It's been a... There's a lot of people. So we thank you to whoever you may be. Yes, we do Magical, mystical person in the night. <laughs> Here we go. So which we want next? We want hit booty swagger, jump no jiggle physics, or you cannot afford my diamond sword. Uh, you cannot afford ah. my diamond sword. Wait, right, wait, wait, wait. Is this headache? Headachey? Yes, yes, it actually. Uh, oh, what's what up, up Mike? What's up, headache? Yes, this is, uh, you, you must then recall our beautiful, um, live stream with Ninja Nation many moons ago where we were doing oh, Q&A. Oh, that was a crazy time. That was a crazy live stream. It was our first interview, really, for the game. Yeah, we should. I feel like we should be doing more of those. We need to. I mean, I have a few, uh, people in the, the pipeline that may be interested in helping us out. So I, it's just a matter of scheduling, man. Yeah, we totally. Just need to get it done. And you know the wonderful benefits of Discord is this is all being streamed. In a sense, like we're looking at Discord right now. So the screen that you're seeing in the stream is from Discord directly. So it, it makes it very easy to do a panel session on yeah. a live stream. A hundred percent. Oh, I know what we can do for this. We can change. We can change this on the animation. The flip. Yeah, we can totally do that. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be easy. Wait. Easy, man. Easy. Let me show you what I'm what I'm talking about here. Okay. Yeah. So be this, great. we unflip it. Okay. We go back. We for running new, we hit record, and then we flip it, and then it adds that to it. At the end of it. Can we do that? No. I feel like it's all Maybe like. Flipped. Then we unflip it, right? Uh, play it and see what happens. Uh, wait, no, we don't have to do that. Actually, we just do this. We do. We just flip it, and then it'll automatically flip back. And then we're done recording. We go to like another one. Let me do. Oh wait, now that this uh, running new, and he should uh, be running the right way. We will find out very soon. Looks yeah. like it is. Like we just use, we just flip it in the animation. Absolutely brilliant. Dude, I mean it's hard not... being the smart. I mean I wake up, I gotta <laughs> eat a bowl of honey smacks, and I gotta drink some sweet tea like the hillbilly I am. Sounds good. Life life's not not easy. Hey, it look is. at that. Cool. <laughs> now all we gotta do is oh my. move up the sprite so it's sitting oh, on the wait, plane. Wait, yes. <laughs> wait. <laughs> oh, it doesn't. <laughs> it was gaming, dude. What just happened? It's big gaming. This is brilliant. Development at its finest, gang. Boom. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is this, is this the gameplay feature right here? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> It's a slide and die. <laughs> it's a slide and turn into tiny hit. Hey, look. <laughs> so wait, if you do the uh, if you do the speed bug, do you go quick? Do you move quick? Okay, and it does. Oh, it does turn back into. Yeah, like you go idle. <laughs> it, it doesn't. I guess it doesn't recognize you moving. That is funny. They just do at the start of the animation. That yeah. is actually really funny. Do you ride like the moonwalking? Look at me. Boom! Look at that. Well, now we aren't saying that this game is complete by any means, y'all. Oh if no! You can see this, this is, is a, a very this is basic what you call sandbox the, uh, yeah, prototype. Great, great this is level one. Finished. Done. Let's go. Hundred percent done, hey, dude. <laughs> this is this is level one in gold. Currently <laughs> yeah, gold. This gold is, phase this right is now. actually how it's gonna get shipped, y'all. Yep. So we're gonna send it off for sixty dollars plus forty-five dollars DLC pack coming in uh, July. 
Ninety-two dollars shipping. You know, Headachey, I <laughs> honestly think that there is. While there's a lot to be done on this screen, there's a lot of behind-the-scenes work that's been put in, man. Like the la if you look at the last two streams that we've done, you can see all of our progress. We've basically kept you guys up to complete date. Uh, the most that we need to end up doing is um, really level design. Yeah, that is our next step in the process. That is our next step. Mm. Absolutely. Mm. All right, Joe, what are you trying to figure out right now? Mm. Um, nothing right now. I, I was eating the chicken nugget. Oh, okay. We love oh, chicken nuggets. Uh, I, I got some Asian zing sauce from like, you know, like the beat up sauce. I okay. got it at the store. And <laughs> I've been going ham on it. I'm not going to lie. Dude, um, I, uh, <laughs> as you know, I ordered Chick fil A with you on top of these earlier. <laughs> there, we, there we go. <laughs> yeah, man. Oh, okay. So apparently, like, hard flips it. Which kind of sucks. So I guess. Well, that just means that we need, to, we need to flip the flip. Well, it's, We're also going like, to have to slow down the player movement or speed up the animation. Yeah, we can do that. That's that's like, that's like one button. Because <laughs> the yeah. legs move faster than the speed, which is fine. But Yeah, they just need to match. Make it a little bit more fidelity. Fidelity. Fidelish. 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 That's our yes. new word, guys. That's the new, new word. word of the night. That's like, All right. <laughs> you gotta see, um, yeah, the DLC does that, the chandelier. In fact, that is the DLC, y'all. The the DLC is the gate and the chandelier. It's just in the sandbox waiting. Yeah. No. no. <laughs> there, are, there are no current plans for a downloadable content pack or expansion to this video game. But you never know. Yeah. I mean, I, I like the progress that we've done so far. Uh, yes. You should see, like, we're, we're gonna, I'm gonna hype up the other departments real quick, Joel. No offense to you, but, like, narrative has been popping off, guys. And I'm so excited for you guys to see what's coming down the pipeline in the next few weeks. There's Absolutely. some huge stuff coming out. So make sure you follow our social medias, and also hop in our Discord if you haven't already, because that's where you're gonna see everything on a first-come, first-served basis, mm -hmm. and it's gonna be wild. Like... We already have stuff in Art Station, and that stuff's magnificent. But when Narrative starts putting out the the lore building blog posts, y'all, it's gonna be it's gonna be game over. And we have a few other surprises in the mix. Yeah, it's gonna be a great time. Yes. All right, we'll get you know we'll, we'll get back to that one. I don't want to get too fixated. No, that's understandable. Let's see. Okay, hit attack one, two, and three. Let's put you down here. That's a good question, sir. Uh, we are currently looking for something around the eight-hour mark for this game. And that'll be primarily dialogue that's going to be, um, that's, that's going to be carrying that. Each, each level is roughly going to be about 15, 20 minutes. And our tentative levels are going to be what? We say 20, right? 20, 20. Yeah, we say around 20 levels. And there will be, I, I don't want to deluge too much of the story, but there will definitely be some stuff in there to uh, keep you busy. Yes, absolutely. Absolutely indeed. So, Joe, what are you doing right now? We're making more spaghetti. <laughs> I see that. What kind spaghetti. of spaghetti, sir? Is it Angel uh, I'm more of a... Honestly, I'm, I'm not much of a spaghetti guy. I'm, I'm more of a penne. Okay. I'm more of a rig rigatoni kind of guy. Rigatoni. Man, we gotta get some, some rotini in here. So, I like the ziti. <laughs> That's me. Oh, dude, I love ziti. Oh, my God. 
Or, uh, Yo, this is the, the development stream 101. We talk about food. Yeah. <laughs> we, bunch, we of fat, things. bunch of fat, ugly Americans talk about food for 60 minutes. You don't break your elbow. That's what I'm buying. You know, I want my cheesecake, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did I do that? Okay, I did not. Let's see. No. Oh, I gotta get rid of that. Uh, which one is this? Oh, no exit time. Okay. Just doing the the fine details right now. Just gotta play with some numbers and all yeah, that. Yeah, just, you know, not constantly breaking the game as developers do best. <laughs> exactly, dude. That's what I'm saying. Every day. <laughs> I get paid by the hour, guys. It's, it's in my favor. Yes, it is. <laughs> Mike, you're a little, you're a little far away from your mic, sir. Yeah, what? it sounds like a connect mic. Connect oh, mic. what if it was? <laughs> well, um, headache, you no, will I'm, have I'm, the ability. You... Let me, let me see if I. Oh have... yeah, you will be absolutely breaking everything. Wait a second, I know why you're. you're... Say something now. Now. Hey, there you are, buddy. I had you slightly. Yeah, he's perfectly out. fine. On the stream, like there's no issue on my side for that. You're well heard, Mike. Well heard. It's okay. Wait. <laughs> how's uh, how's Ninja Nation? I failed really, really bad. Today. So progress, gotcha. Yeah, I got, <laughs> I got greedy in a vault and I lost everything. That happens. The I got really greedy in the vault. Did you run out of time or die? I ran out of time. Oh. There was just, there was so much, there was so much stuff, and I wanted it. I wanted it all. And then I ran out of space for things, and I was like, oh, it's time to go. And then suddenly, um, yes, bad, bad, bad things. Very, very bad things. Yeah, we call this the oh, new sure. move. It's the look behind your back. Yeah. The behind your back kill. The trick shot. <laughs> oh my gosh have you seen the um oh wait no that's not that's not outlast that's uh what are you shoot. talking about we're uh the the chat the okay dark souls has a wall that you have to hit 50 times in order to get through it mm. but that's like an intended feature according to the devs and they, they went in and they patched it that was an intended but, uh, feature to drive okay, everybody insane intended, i see yeah, they they claimed it, it was in air quotes as they proceed to patch it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's only on purpose. Switch we're gonna out. we're gonna make this game so hard that you have to physically run into a wall fifty times before you can go anywhere. Oh, that makes perfect sense, dude. I wouldn't put it past them. But doesn't tell well, anybody get about it. For, get ready for get ready for some class action us. lawsuits. Yeah. We wouldn't do that, guys. Hint, hint, wink, wink, nudge, nudge. <laughs> Oh no, but we will absolutely be making you run into walls. That will be a thing. That, that's, that's just fun. Wait, is it going to be like a platform three quarters? Well, when I say run into walls, I mean... Literally running into walls. Oh, we're going to have to speed those animations up You have all so the time in the world? Fast. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's just double it. Start with that. I mean, it so looks right, good. Right now, Hit only has one attack animation. What? Well, one modern one. So the other two additional ones would probably be deactivated. Yes. <laughs> kind of looks like. Uh, it's like I'm getting. I think I'm getting there. Oh, I think of that. What? What's that? What's the name of that one cartoon sound, dude? Uh, it's like it's like the Flintstones when they're running. Goes. Bla -la 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 -la. Oh yeah, when they're running yeah, faster than they're actually moving. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's so good. Yeah, that definitely still needs some tweaking. But I mean, that's uh, as simple as shifting the uh, the speed of the animation itself. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like spacing it out a little bit. Spacing it out. What do you mean? In the animation spreadsheet. The distance between. Oh, right, right, right. Yep. Oh, uh, we can do that. I mean, we can just do it like this, too. Boom. Okay. 
We like playing with numbers here. It's a great time. We do. That's, that's <laughs> I like it when I like it when small numbers go big. See, maybe maybe a little faster. Welcome, Soul Vampire. Welcome, welcome. What's up? How are we doing this evening? And we appreciate like the follow. Like yeah, thanks for the follow. We like growing, don't we, Nick? Oh, we do. It's it's one of my favorite things. Yeah, it's a, it's a great time. Uh, mm -hmm. We started out at what literally i mean we oh hey well, welcome to the yeah no there was just two of us and then i love it <laughs> so to give you a basic idea this is a sandbox right now uh the question is so how long how far along are we um we have a lot of art assets done and for we're actually in the process of sandboxing level. all of the core mechanics. Yeah, pretty much for the first level. We yeah. intend to make around 20 of them. But right now, we're actually in the process of implementing animations yes. and our current sprites. So, like, what you see there, that tiny one was what we originally started with. And then we actually had an artist go in and actually remake it to fit more of our style. And as a result of that... Joel gets to have a fun time of playing in. with numbers. Yeah, Joel has a <laughs> good time of being the developer here. He's doing development stuff. D6. Uh, yeah, I'm just making a still frame at the end of the animation. Okay. Oh. What does the still frame do? Nice is it just... Uh, like, like, what do you, like what we did with the loading screen one. Oh, okay. Where it's like a pause. Gotcha. Okay. Oh, uh, that's cool, Joel. We're doing a something similar. It's a two and a half D platformer RPG action adventure style thing um, that will be playable on Steam. And maybe some other platforms. We haven't decided yet. Slamuchi. What's up, Slam? Uh, Slam. Yeah, how you doing? Hey, Slam. I mean, Slamucci, I'm going to go with Slam. I think it's Moochie. <laughs> Is that an I or an L? I honestly can't tell. It's a, it's a Moochie, so... Moochie. What's up, Moochie? Appreciate the follow. Or Moochul. Actually, that is a good question. Slamucci. It's whatever you want it to be. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Just don't call you... Just thank you for the follow. <laughs> we, uh, we appreciate it. that. We're just the uh, gods of. That's that's interesting. Uh, self promotion is uh, not exactly the best thing to do on the stream, but we greatly appreciate you for letting us know, and uh, we hope to see you in our creator channel on Discord. Absolutely. Join the join the Discord community and uh, tell us all about your game, man. You yep. can go to uh, Link our is creator in stuff. chat. Yes, it Discord. is. Feel free to. Join. Yeah, no, something like this one. Like the little pause, you know, just put so another frame. I, I got a question. Map, is trail. when you change the speed, is that the move speed or is that the speed of the animation playing? Uh, animation speed. So the move speed is different. The move speed? Yeah, no, no, no. Speed. It's just uh, the speed of the animation. Okay. Just that. So this, this is six times speed. So if we change it to, just change it back to one. Then we'll just do this. Functionality wise, it functions exactly as it should. Okay. Like you have half a second to perform another attack. Otherwise, it uh, goes like it locks you out of attacking for a little bit. Like I don't. Like uh, yeah. Otherwise, it goes back to like the default. Gotcha. Okay. That's not... it's... Does it do that? Oh, right, it's tied to the animation. I forgot about that. I, I but... agree with that. It's something... So, when our artists went through and did this, uh, 
she actually this is one of her first forays into animation so she did a great job in my opinion we are gonna go back and probably do another pass with the animations to make sure that they are in the best shape that they possibly can See, yeah we, that we do appreciate all the feedback yes All right, so it's time for Hit Booty Swagger. Oh, I suppose. I Hit Booty Swagger. Hit Booty Swagger. Let's do it. So that is in fact a different ASM entirely, Joel. Yeah, this will be a brand new one. Mm -hmm. Wait, what's because that? Oh, you want to make that one's a, a little one. bit of a special situation that we yeah. haven't talked about. So the one that you're about to bring in is going to operate on the Z axis for a specific section of this level. Oh. Yeah. Oh, is it lewd? Uh-oh. Uh, no, it's not It's not that lewd. There's no booty swagger. Let's see. Let's... Uh, we, uh, we will take any and all let's feedback. See. Let's the, see the, the current animation is what will stand as of right now. Let's see. Oh, it's like a... Okay, okay. I see. Is it when we're doing the okay? Yes. I think I I think I realize. Okay, I'll just make the animation for now. We'll get back to that. Hit movement Z. Yeah, that works. Okay. <laughs> What's the name of this thing, dude? A hit Pixar dumpy swagger. <laughs> so, <laughs> <laughs> so there, there's a reason for that that's internal, and it's quite Pixar, funny. Pixar it's Dumpy quite, Swagger. I mean, say no more. What, what else needs to be funny. said here? Guys, where's the Pixar Mom Dumpy, y'all? Oh, <laughs> why do Pixar Moms? You Say no more, dude. <laughs> Was it that Aunt What's-Her-Face from Big Hero 6? Oh, my oh, God, absolutely. dude. absolutely. <laughs> All right, never mind, never mind. We got to change topics here. <laughs> Get a little hot and bothered here, right? Ah. <laughs> Okay, uh, we got that. I guess we're not doing anything with that. Jump no jiggle physics. Money doesn't jiggle jiggle, it folds, y'all. Very cool. Yeah, mine just pays bills, dog. I never see it. Oh, that's... So, <laughs> someone in the chat wants to see Dog. the animation frames. They want to see the deets, the dirty deets. Ooh. Oh. Like the keyframing stuff? Yeah, or... it sounds like it. Which specific okay. one? The walking, yeah, which one the jumping, you want? the sword swing. Our, oh, we can probably put this in. Uh, yeah, we'll do that here. Hit. Still jump. The walking frames. Jumpy, jumpy. Specifically the walking frames. Oh, the walking frames? Yeah, that's it. Let's take a look at uh, this work here. Okay. Hit running. Okay, so we start. Here's frame zero. Let's get rid of that little thing there. Is, uh, that would be the current walking hit, frame. Yeah, yeah. Hit, hit the barbarian the little grocery store jog. <laughs> <laughs> she just needs like a shopping cart. Great. Say, oh, say, oh crap, I dropped a quarter. <laughs> Not a quarter. I was, gonna, I, was gonna, I was gonna put it in the coin star and get some real stuff out of it. <laughs> uh, yeah, it looks pretty good. I wish it would loop into itself better. But that's okay. We can do Maybe. that though. We can edit the um, that that first starting frame right there can be removed. Yeah, first frame. Okay. Now sure. let's see this beauty. Uh, maybe let's see. Not enough movement in the legs from the hips. Looks a bit stiff. Okay. Yeah, Thanks I feel for the feedback. 
I do feel that. I, I agree. Like Rookie of this engine after. is a lot different than. Uh, it, but you know what? Maybe we can. Maybe we can still salvage. See, now it, it doesn't loop properly back into itself. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, work in progress. That's fine. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh, well, I mean, this is this is what we do. Like this is. Well, thank you. Thank you, Soul. Oh, that's better. It's a little better. So, uh, it has got short, stubby legs. She does. It's a smidge, but they're her short, stubby legs. <laughs> I was hoping she'd be a six foot three Amazonian that could choke me out at like a bar fight. All right, <laughs> that, that's a little bit too much, though. So. <laughs> <laughs> wow! Well, don't don't reel them in. <laughs> uh, pixel size for characters. That is an art question. I do not know that off the top of my head. Um, yep. We can we can pull a resource. See, let's uh, let's see, let's see. It's 150 by 150. This picture. Yeah, th these are all 150 by 150. Uh, you know, of course, including alpha. There you go. There's your answer. See sprite editor. Let's see. Let's do let's do some cool math here. We like math, all right? Mm-hmm. I can't. Oh, how did I do that thing I did last time? Oh, jeez. Right click. All right, let's. Okay. Right click. Oh, it just drags. Cringe. <laughs> I tried. All right. Well, I can't highlight it, but I mean. Including alpha, it looks it's 150 by 150. I'm gonna guesstimate this to be like maybe add a little, be a little generous on each side, maybe like 25 by like 50 something, 60 something. That makes sense. I think they were specifically <laughs> referring to whether it's 8 bit, 16, or 24 or 32 bit character spreadsheet. Oh, I got you. And that I. I'm Do gonna not guess know off the top 60. of my head. I think it's 16, because 8-bit is a bit too... Yeah, this is 8-bit right here, for sure. No, I'm kidding. Absolutely, that's totally 8-bit. 8-bit <laughs> is a... The white space okay. on the character is currently, I want to say 100? That's probably the 150 by 150, to be completely honest. That's again an art question. Development is strictly about making it work. I just fight Unity the whole time. Yeah, we just we just like to pound around Unity. Jumping. Now, <laughs> nice Mike. <laughs> um, so you should tune in to our next art stream whenever that may be. It could be in the next coming weeks. I believe Narrative is the next on the roster. So if anyone has any yeah. world building questions, that'll be for them. Ooh. And then oh my God. after I that, I hit. I do that sometimes. I try to hit Control S to save. Yeah. But then I hit. I'm, I'm my fingers are moved over, so I hit Windows D and close everything out. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's always good. We like that. Yeah. That happens every now and then. <laughs> oh, that's great. All right. And now we get in the nitty gritty here. Yeah. Let's see. All right, we don't have a fall animation yet, do we? Uh, no. Okay. We do not. So I just have to I'll have to put it with this thing. What we'll probably end up doing, and I'm not sure. Do we really have the? Hey, that's a question for later. <laughs> Do it the way. So actually, that's a really good point there. Um, so if you look at our collision box, collision box. Let's see. Collision boxes. Yeah, little boxy. Oh, do our, I have our, our boy? Our, our girl, actually. 
Yeah, so it actually is rather form-fitting to the character. It's something that we do in Engine, not For something that specific that we... one. Yeah. Uh, check the run one real quick. Yeah. Oh, the run? Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. It'll still maintain the original hitbox. I'm, yes, so know, it probably doesn't the... forfeit. Yeah, that will be adjusted. Yeah. We haven't, like I said. Yeah, yeah like, if, like if an attack goes this goes up here, it's not going to hit. But... Yep. That's uh, I'll do that whenever all the animations are put together. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Once everything is solid, that's the kind of the last thing that we do. <laughs> oh my god! Bless you. At least I'm now blessed. we have a better idea as the scale, to size of the level she mm. is, and general idea of what it looks like in game. Well, in engine, not in game. Yep. Uh, basically, this little square handles all the collision. Yep, that's and like all the functionality will be shifted. And that's what like talks to all these other scripts here. Mm -hmm. And tells him, hey, do this, hey, do that. So, you know, if this is happening, blah, blah. Uh, let's see, double jump. I gotta like copy all these notes, which kind of sucks. Jumping. It's like taking a screenshot of oh, it and rebooting it from a screenshot. Uh, not just a screenshot, because there's, like, specific transition parameters uh, here yeah, yeah. between well, when animations. I, when I was working in the ASM state machine, I literally pulled everything to the side and just reorganized it. Mm -hmm. That was back in the day, though. Oh, back in the good old days. Back, back, back prior to when we did not have Joel. It was <laughs> beauty. Yes, yeah, so we have a Joel now, He's so... <laughs> when in doubt, Joel. you gotta go to the Joel store, and you just gotta get one of them. Yeah, they're yeah. pretty cool. I, I think they're on sale. Oh! <laughs> I might have to go pick up another one. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> do, they, do they come in different moods? Oh, the, yeah, they're like... We've got an angry oh, no, Joel, it's kinda... a nice Joel, a crazy uh, Joel. The, no, it's it's more like like Hawaiian t-shirt Joel. Oh, like, okay. So oh, they, okay, like, so you're one of those. Like, <laughs> yeah, like high, yeah, they're like Funko Pops. Oh, okay. <laughs> you, <laughs> you gotta get the whole collection. You'll get a big bucks. Okay. Thank you, Saul. Once again, for the great feedback. Put three on the side, two on I think I can get rid of this. See how this plays out. See how it plays out. Say like times three, I'm gonna guess that. Okay. Let's and go let's watch we'll do this magic thing. happen. Woo. Let's do that thing, man. Oh yeah, yeah. We like doing things. We do. For those that join the Discord server during this stream, please accept the rules. So that you can talk. Okay. Boom. <laughs> that... Okay, Wait, what is it? I, I do gotta say that the jump looks a little janky. <laughs> it looks like... Oh, he's, just, he's just like, going and like... <laughs> <laughs> let, let, let me see what this it looks, looks like. like. Boing. Yeah, I wanna see what this looks like. This is pretty cool. Still jump. <laughs> Oh, it's got a it's got a big wind up. That's the thing. So that means that our jump needs to be way shorter. You just gotta yeah. Trigger. Yeah. One thing that we're learning is it's got to be played to be able to loop, not a one-time jump thing. Probably yes. get like get rid of these like five. Oh, oh, that's a standing is. jump. Did we... yeah, she got moon shoes. <laughs> like, run, run, doink. <laughs> doink. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah, it's like a steel jump. I think uh, we can probably keep that. And I can just add some more parameters. And then we could also request like a, a running jump. Yes. Or, you know, keep some variation. Of this, like of the, course, the, you uh... Know, if you want it to... The Mario jump, the, the jump spread legs type thing. 
Uh, spread his legs, arms in air. Mm -hmm. Ready to flying fist somebody? Mm -hmm. Okay, cool, cool. Is it showing the shader right now? Is that what it's doing? The shader? Uh, no. No, because it's. Oh, it, right, it, I forgot to change the thing. Oh. I'm gonna remove that thing. Okay, this yeah. is it. I keep forgetting that the filter thing. There we go. Yeah. And see, see how you play out. We will pass it along to the art team. We appreciate the feedback. <laughs> so a, a little <laughs> bit of uh, history Charlie. about us. We actually, everyone here is pretty much, this is their first foray into anything like this outside of a, a college setting. Mm -hmm. So we are all learning and we greatly appreciate your feedback because everything that you say, we're, we're taking to heart. So we, again, we greatly appreciate it. Yep. And we makes it a better game. Mm -hmm. Maybe we can get rid of these, these landing frames. They kind of, they kind of look wonky in here. I, I just don't need them. All right, guys. Well, the stream will be ending in about four minutes. Oh, jeez, man. Come on, man. Yeah, yeah I know. We've been more. having so Come much on. fun. Come on. Can I just bum a new port off you or something? Come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> you got a light. Yeah, yeah you got a light. All right. <laughs> you got a light. All right, dude. Uh, I'd be too quick. Uh, you got to be quicker than that. Oh, <laughs> I got you a dollar. No, because that's how they start talking, and then she tells all her friends, and no one likes you anymore. Don't do it. How do I? What the fuck? I do find it funny how there, there's no. It's just a. I guess we're running to a doink. <laughs> I, I, I just like this. It's I just know, like it's great. A little pixel character chilling next. It's like hyper realistic pixel lady going on a grocery store run. Ah, <laughs> oh, where's IO4 again? <laughs> Alright, that, uh, that was pretty chill. You hammer this stuff out, I suppose. In due time. Yeah, absolutely. No, I mean, as a first trial of entering and putting in the new animation. Yeah, man. Do you want to? Do you guys want to see anything else? Anything the else I've done in the past? Three minutes. Uh, the uh, yeah. any surprises that you want to share with the class? Uh, I mean, I'm not really much for surprises. Uh, personally, I can show off the little boss guy, I suppose. Uh, he doesn't really do anything in terms of like like actually attacking you, but the AI functionality is all there. I guess I will go ahead and explain gamer speak what's going on. Yeah. <clears throat> so basically this is just the this is the Oh cool, very nice. <laughs> oh. Very cool. <laughs> look at that, look at that. Yo, Ooh, this is the crash. feature. This is the intended feature of uh, you know. what's going on here. <laughs> yeah, you need crashing. It's a it's a great sign. It's the first time it's happened in a while actually. It, it hasn't happened like all week. No, that's oh, fine. That means but, uh, like the last boss animation state is broken. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. No, but that's uh, like three times one day. Uh, I got so mad. That does sound like a pretty good starting, uh, stopping spot here, Joel. Because then it's going <laughs> to take a minute, too. <laughs> so, <laughs> actually, awesome. Sam, to answer your question quickly, because our, our stream is wrapping up, unfortunately, we are actually. It's a four stage boss battle that we have mm -hmm. sort of implemented here. Um, once the boss degrades 25% health, he enters this rage mode where he's actually untouchable and then some sort of animation place. Mm -hmm. And then that stage continuously goes down for each 25% increment. 
Um, and the way that Joe has programmed this, it, it makes sense. And we're very excited to show it. You won't see the first boss battle until, um, level five. actually, if you, until about level five. Yeah. And, so, uh, I can go over yeah, it real go. quick. It's all pulled up. Go uh, basically it. he starts out, the guy starts out in the sleep state. Mm -hmm. You got all these different like states that the, uh, this guy transitions to based on what's going on around him. So right now he's sleeping. He's just playing this little idle animation. And the second we enter like a specific like line of sight box that he casts out forward now he's transitioned over to let's see go ahead buddy yeah now he's woken up he's going to attack transition then he's going to decide which attack he's doing which is attack say three mm -hmm. he stays in that uh stays in that attack pattern for like 10 seconds and then keeps cycling through a choice of four attack animations and th these are just like uh <clears throat> These will basically just be like standardized attack patterns. Like think, think like, like for range, ranged bosses. Think like bullet hell kind of stuff. Where they just throw projectiles at you, a whole bunch of them. And you just gotta jump over them and dodge them, and all that stuff. Gotcha. Okay. And then, uh, yeah, and and during his t attack transitions, whenever he's not physically attacking, he's impossible to damage. So, so now he's in the attack state, and we hit him. We hit him, we get him down to 70% health. Now we can't hit him. He's doing, right now he'd be doing like a little rage animation. Every 25% damage you do to him, he goes to health stage transition, which is just a, you know, like, a, ah, dude, you hit me, I'm, I'm all mad kind of thing. Mm -hmm. He goes from health stage transition, goes back to transition uh, for attack, down to attack type, which he decides between like, you know, attack states one and two or attack states three and four. Basically, just does a coin flip and then does a coin flip again to determine which of the two that he lands on, to okay. determine which attack he does. It's just it's just a double coin flip, really. And now we're gonna beat him up a little bit more. Got him down to fifty percent. He's mad. He's mad. He's mad. Can't hit him. Now we can hit him again. Of course, this uh, this does make for very exciting gameplay, but <laughs> not yet. The, it will functionality wise. Yeah. It's it's there. Yeah, once we add animations in, it'll look a little, a little bit pretty and some UI work. Maybe to add like a boss health bar. A hundred percent. Absolutely. All right, gang. Well, any closing remarks, Joel? Well, thank you for tuning in. Um, just be, be thankful that we're not doing face cams. You won't have to see my mug. <laughs> <laughs> nope. I'm the only one on face cam. That's fine. I'm okay with oh, that. You're, oh, you're. Okay, yeah, I, I am. See. Somebody's got to be on camera. <laughs> I hear you. <laughs> No, well, we're good you, here. you guys count your blessings. Pick it. I, I'm glad you guys picked a god and prayed to him. So, <laughs> absolutely. But all right, Joe, it was really nice. Uh, and this ends week four of our <laughs> Scorpion <laughs> showcase, and we look forward to week number five. Uh, I believe yep. it'll be with narrative. Yep. What's next? Oh, na na narrative. Uh, which one? Which one you guys doing? Which guy? We uh, have not decided we that yet. Aren't sure yet. We will find um, out. Yeah, Point based flip. on availability. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. But until then, you guys have a great night, and see you next week. Yeah. Good night, guys. Stay Thanks. beautiful. Yeah. Have a good night. <laughs>